Hey everyone, today we're gonna to be doing an ab standing series. You will need medium weights. These are five pounds, so let's hop right into it. We're just gonna grab the weights and to start off, we're just gonna kick them to the side. Throughout all these exercises, I want you to really focus on engaging those abs. I want you to find that mind to muscle connection. So even if we're working arms, I want you to use that core to drive you through every motion. For 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. Reach those arms up to the ceiling. Bring that left knee in, bring that right knee in, and Shoulder press. This exercise, I want you to use that core to drive that knee up and not the hip. There we go. Four, eight. Seven. Six. Four, three, two, and one. Great job. We're going to drop one of the weights. Okay, this exercise, we're going to bend that right knee. That left leg comes in front. We're reaching the arm up to the ceiling. Really engage that core, so pull the abdominals in. We're slowly gonna bring that knee up and we're extending that left leg in front. Your whole upper body is leaning backwards a little bit. So we're purely using those abs to drive you through this motion, slow and controlled. That knee is not coming any further than that hip height. Four, eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Great job. Okay, we're bringing that right arm into a bandit. We're gonna cross over and slowly opening up. All that weight is into the right side of the body. Keep a slight bend into that standing heel. Four, ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two, and one. Bring that weight in front, slight bend into your heel. We're lifting that left leg up and slowly lower down. I want you to really engage that core right here. Four, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, and one. Hold it here, tiny pulses up and down. Engage that core for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And slowly lower down, great job. Okay, we're keeping that arm onto that right. Hand, reach it up to the ceiling. Engage that core, the chest is open. The left arm come behind your left leg. And then slowly we're lowering down as far as possible and slowly coming back up. We're really getting into that side oblique right here. So we're reaching up and down for 10. 
nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job, bring the arm down. Bring the left hand under the dumbbell, the right arm comes on top, we're reaching over and slowly lowering down. Reaching up and lower down for 10. Nine. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And rotate, so the right hand comes underneath, the left hand is on top. We're reaching over to the left side and this time coming down to the right. I want you to really engage that core, really feel that whole upper body twisting right here for 10. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. Okay, this time we're gonna switch to the other side. So we're extending that right leg long, slight bend into that left knee. The arms come in front, reach it up to the ceiling. I want you to really stretch out that core and lean a little bit backwards. So you almost have like one line between that arm and between that leg. Take a deep inhale. We're slowly bringing that knee towards the elbow with that knee not coming further than that hip height and extending out. I want you to lean a little bit backwards so that core is fully activated. There we go. Reach in and reach out, slow and controlled for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, and one, great job. Slowly bring it in, reach that leg to the right, that left elbow comes into a 90 degree angle. We're slowly reaching that left elbow to that right knee and opening up. Reach in and open up. Let's move here so you can see me. So we're reaching over, crossing those obliques, engage that core right here for eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. Bring those, that weight right in front. Slide bend into that left heel. Open up that chest. We're gonna lift that right leg up and slowly lower down. That core should be helping here to balance and stabilize while that leg is working too. So we're tapping and coming up. There we go for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, hold it here, tiny circles up and down. Little pulses for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. 
doing a great job. So that weight comes into the right hand, reach that left arm up to the ceiling. We're slowly lowering down and reaching back up. Engage that core and slowly lower down and up. We're really getting into the left side of the obliques. Keep breathing for 10. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four, three, two, and one. And slowly down and down. Great job. Coming into our knees up and down for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, great job. Okay, I want you to grab a one weight here. We're gonna work on some extension throughout the core. This will really give you those divine look. Slight bend into those heels, legs are parallel. We're gonna step back that left leg and then slowly reach that arm up, extending that core and coming back in. Extending out, reach up and coming back in. Extend out and reach up. Those eyes are following that weight. Stepping out and reach up. Four, six. Five. Four, blowing controls. Three, four, and one. Great job. We're gonna reach those arms long as the whole of our body goes forward, bringing the arms in and the legs in and bringing that out. straight to the other side. Same thing, legs are parallel to each other, slight bend into those heels. That weight is nice in front, we're stepping back with that right leg, squeeze those glutes, and then we're reaching up to the ceiling. We're really lengthening and extending that core, getting those defined muscles and reaching back and reaching back up. One, great job. Bringing the arms and the legs in and reaching out at the same time. Reach out and in for 10, nine. Two, and one. Great job. Drop that weight. We're coming into those arms, we're just gonna twist and switch. Really use that core right here to drive that knee up. Get that pace up. Four, ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. 
four, three, two, and one. Great job, shake it out. We're going to grab one of those weights. We're gonna reach it forward around the world and reach it out and switch sides. Great job. Okay, this time we're going to, every time we're coming up, we're bringing the knees in around the world and other side. Keep breathing. There we go, four, three. Two, one more. And one, okay, just keep it high here. We're just lifting those knees up. I want you to really use that core right here. Eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, and one. Great job, slowly lower down. Okay, do you guys still remember infinity, infinity sign? I want you to slowly make this movement right here with your arms, but really throughout this exercise, engage that core and drive you through the motion. So a big infinity sign right here slow and controlled, engage that core, and keep breathing. Those shoulders are nice and relaxed. Remind yourself, squeeze those abdominals. I know we're also feeling this into our arms, but this is a true exercise right here. For three, two, and one. Okay, last one, reaching up and over. Slow and controlled. Okay, reaching up and down for three, two, and one. And switch to the other side. Four, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, and one. Great job, we're grabbing our weight. Last one, getting into those arm pulses. Every time we're coming up, I want you to really reach through the side. Feel that twist into those obliques for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, and one. You are all done for today. Thank you so much for joining. You can always find extra express workouts in the library or some extra stretches. I will see you very soon.